Home Depot, where all your dreams come true and your bank account goes to zero. I'm here in the bus. I'm actually, we're sitting at Home Depot. We didn't have anything big enough to pick up all the plywood that we needed, so we figured let's take the bus. We kind of use this as our moving storage unit. I'm just working on the video for the time you see this, it'll be either a week ago or two weeks ago. Sean is inside picking up plywood to start putting up our ceiling panels in the back. We're gonna continue on from that back one and then hopefully start building a little bit of our bathroom wall today. Another one. What are you saying? I said, now I've got my own. Isn't it wonderful? It's a good idea. I just like how it looks. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna measure the size of this square, 14 inches in, and it should just fit. But the top part, like this one has the skylight. So Sean has been measuring like a crazy person. I think I've got it. Here we go. Very gentle. Okay. You ready? Yeah. It's okay, you got another one. Yeah, right, if I screw it up. I didn't overshoot it. If I undershot it, it's fine. Look at this thing. Four dimension. Shout out to four dimension, wherever you are. Okay. Moment, of, right. moment of truth. God, I hope it fits. <laughs> Come out, it's done, kid. When you have a piece of, you know, machinery like this, it's, it's really amazing. Putting up the other side wall to the bathroom now. It's little, but right. it'll do its job. And we're still debating putting a skylight in over the shower. You guys vote, should we do skylight in the shower? Yeah or nay? So we are officially sealing up this window. Um, we showed you guys last week, but I put the blackout film on the window. And then this one actually, this is a great tip that we learned from Tio Aventura. They told us about. Um, our windows, as you can see here, kind of had these little cracks in them that we just wanted sealed. So we found these things and it's just, uh, I don't know. It's like spring-loaded Home Depot or something. Thing. It's just a spring-loaded thing to keep it super, super sealed. And then I cut out a piece of two-inch insulation to go in here and I'm just gonna spray foam it shut forever. Dad, yeah. how do you feel about us having the bus in the front yard? Uh, I think it's okay at the moment. If there's no giant oil spills, 
old uh, be stove. a lot better. Okay. Maybe you could make sure of that. How's our neighbor feel? Hey Jim, why don't you come on over for a second? <laughs> He's shy. We'll get him another time. All right, looks like uh, Sean and Ash are now installing the ceiling. We'll take a closer look. Okay. Sean, you measured that and it was accurate? Yeah, I mean, I just measured the length from the other ceiling tile to this one. And then I measured dead center on the board. And then I measured the box. It's 23 and a half all around. And just cut a square. You did want a math award. I guess. Is that true, Sean? You want a math award? It definitely needs to be sanded down and fit to the square, but I think it's pretty much where we want it to be. I just don't want to drop it. You're sweating. Whoa! Okay, so we need something to hold these up, maybe. Yeah. It, you mean the towel? Alright, I'm gonna stop and help. Shimmy Shanga, Shimmy Shake, it. Oh God. Looks like a mess now, but once we sand it all down, it'll be good. Just using liquid nails here to keep that side up. I wanted to screw into this metal beam, but I'll do that with the next piece. Let's go cut some more wood. So I've begun grinding and cutting it down to size and then I'm gonna sand it and they'll cover we'll cover it up with molding. Um, hey Ashley, you know, it's just, I told you the last time I met Stevie Wonder, it's amazing how many famous people I meet, and it's just the strangest thing how often it happens to me. It started when I was 14, and when I was 14 years old, I went to Atlantic City, and I went into a jacuzzi, and uh, I'm sitting in the jacuzzi at 14 years old after I just shaved for the first time, and in walks Cher, sits down right next to me, Cher. You know, I'm who's who. And talked to her for like a half hour. She invited me to a show. These are the type of things that happen to me. Why do you think they happen to you? I don't know. 